friends. Money? <laughs> we are sitting on the couch and sharing a bowl of cereal. And we'll see you guys in the next clip. Bye! Bye! Bye, Bye guys! <laughs> Today is our four year wedding anniversary. We're going to be basically celebrating over the weekend. Um, and today is actual, the actual day. So we got married through the courts on the 9th and then we actually had our wedding day and stuff on the 10th of December. So we made these when we got married. They're like our little like wedding pictures and these were our thank yous and it just says we are blessed to have you have had have had you share our special day and then it says love Mr. and Mrs. Ramirez and then it just has pictures of us. My hair was brown, like dark brown at that time. And then this is a picture of that. <laughs> it's really funny. When we were dating we went to uh, the circus. And this random lady was taking pictures, and we didn't know, like, she was just like, picture? And then we just turned around and was like, Ch -ch -ch. okay, we'll give it to you at the end of the, uh, at the end of the show. So, this is what happened. <laughs> Look how funny, my hair is like, a poodle hair, and then my, I'm on my phone, and then my husband's like, what? <laughs> I love that picture. And then that, there's a random little boy in the background. But it was just me and him, and we went to the circus, and it's like the funniest. I love this picture. And then um, I have this. We had bought in a little flag for our honeymoon that says "Just Married," and this is just what, um, like the little cardboard part of it that was um, that it was packaged in. It was like in a little plastic package, and then it had the little "Just Married" sign. But since our flag totally got messed up. I couldn't save it, so I got to save the little, like, cardboard of it. Um, and then when we were on our honeymoon, we went to Big Bear for our honeymoon, um, and um, Big Bear is, like, mountains and cabins, and it's, it's really beautiful. Um, and it actually snowed the day after we got there. It was, it was absolutely amazing. Um, and we went to the little shops, and I found this, and I got it. It says Liz, and it's a little candy cane. Um, but I hadn't found it until today, so I haven't been able to put it on my tree after four years. So this year is going to be the first year that my little candy cane from our honeymoon is going to go on our tree. So I'm really excited to add that to our um, collection of things that are going to be on our Christmas tree every year. Um, and then this last picture is when we were dating also. Uh, this was at my mom's Hawaiian birthday. It was... I think it was her 50 something birthday um, but it's us when I bought him that shirt and um, and I told him oh you have to wear it because everybody's gonna be dressed um, Hawaiian like in Hawaiian style and my hair is red but that's us how cute and crazy and I couldn't even believe it but my hair was up and he absolutely loved it like I hadn't really worn my hair up around him and then he was like, wow, your hair looks really nice. And his hair is super curly in this picture. I love his curly hair. But he doesn't like to have it curly, so he, like, cuts it really short. But, yeah, how cute. <laughs> so today I am reminiscing um, over the past four years. They've been absolutely challenging and amazing in every way. And, um... Yeah, I, I really love him so much, and it's just nice to see that after four years, we're still going strong, and and I love him, and I'm just really happy. So, babe, if you're watching this, I love you, and I'm so happy to be your wife, and you're absolutely amazing, and I'm looking, to, I'm looking forward to many, 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 many more years besides you. So, yeah. All right, guys, I'll see you in the next clip. And I hope you guys have enjoyed this quick little reminisce. And now I'm um, with my towel. And I'm gonna eat some pizza, leftover pizza for lunch. Um, it was really good. I didn't get to like really tell you guys. It is on um, wheat crust, and then the pepperonis are the pepperonis all are are yeah. There you go. The pepperonis are turkey pepperonis, so a little bit lighter. 
Um, but I mean, obviously, it's still good. So I'm gonna eat some of that, and I'll see you guys in the next clip. Bye. Oh, in the next clip, we're gonna be doing a project because I think it's gonna be fun to do little projects with my son every vlog up till Christmas. So hopefully, we could do that. We'll see you guys in the next clip. Bye. All right, guys. So now we're gonna be doing a little project for you guys today to talk about the reason for the season. So let's get to it. We're gonna be needing for this project. We're gonna be needing some brown paint, some gold or yellow paint. You can also do this with crayons if you'd like to, um, but you do need the brown paint for sure. You're also gonna need some glue. Hi, look. Wow. Some pe a pen or a marker. Um, you're gonna be needing some scissors. You're gonna be needing some white paper and a background paper. I'm using this very pretty sparkly glitter paper. Um, but you can use regular construction paper of any color. And we're going to be Let using, be. yeah, we're going to be using some stickers. Um, you can also use the pen and just write what we're going to, um, yeah, you can also write what we're going to put on there. So let's get to it. We have our paint brushes and we're going to start off. Okay. Okay. On the paper. So you're going to want to glue your white piece of paper to your construction paper so that the construction paper is like your backdrop for your picture. So you're just going to flip it over, try to line it up however you'd like on your construction paper. And that looks alright. Then you're just going to flatten that guy out. And there you go, we have like a pretty little backdrop. So you want to get to the messy part, which is painting your child's hair. The brown is going to be like the little um, crate or um, wooden box that Jesus would have been laying in in the manger. Once you have that, now you're going to want to just get some of your gold or yellow paint that you have. Oh no. There it goes. I'm using gold because this gold paint is actually really pretty. So I'm going to use some gold paint. And all we're going to do is draw like the hay that he would have been laying on top of. So we're just gonna just, I will show you guys. We're just gonna do little lines like this. And that will be like the hay that he's gonna be laying on. Something like this. Okay. And now once you are done with that, you're gonna wanna take another one of your white construction papers and we're gonna wanna draw baby Jesus. So basically, we're first gonna start off with a circle for his head. Circle. And then his body is gonna be kind of um, like, a, how can I say it? Like if, like if you put your thumb, you could trace your thumb, that'll be, that'll be fine. So let's trace our thumb like that. And over. So it's gonna look like this, like if he's wrapped up in a blanket. Okay, and once you have that, then you're gonna wanna just add little details like a happy face, cute little eyes. And if you'd like to, you can add some little hair, which is optional. You can be without hair. So this is our little baby Jesus. 
Oh, I missed it. No, you're going to help me. So now once you have that, you're going to want to cut them out. And if you'd like to, you can use crayons to color him in. My way, I help you. Okay, help. Push. Good. Okay, so you guys can use some crayons. Should we should we color him blue? Mommy, a baby. Yeah, but he needs to be colored like this. Show them. Show them the baby. Put it close to the camera. Once you have your baby, you're going to just glue him onto the little hay, and it should look something like this. Yay! Alright, and Yay. now we're going to go back and we're going to get our stickers, and we're going to write, Jesus is the reason for the season. project up close and we'll put the year on it because that little hand is gonna grow someday <laughs> so it says Jesus is the reason for the season I hope you guys have liked this project and we'll see you guys in the rest of the vlog bye bye here with all of our little stockings how cute is that Ta -da! Look. Look, see? I see. Tell them about your book. I work, mine. What's that? I'm going to turn it around here. But I'm like halfway ready when I come home. I want to look really nice for my hubby today and I want to put maybe like a dress on or something and I mean we're just gonna be home but I still want to look a little bit nicer than I usually do. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna go to school right now because I need to um, see a counselor and take some papers and all that kind of boring stuff but I'm sorry but you're coming with me. We're now and we're gonna get going. I'm gonna put my seatbelt on because safety first. <laughs> and I left the little one already with his um, babysitter and we're gonna get going. So I will see you guys there when we get there. I'm crossing my fingers and praying that there is gonna be a parking and I won't have to pay money to park. <sighs> All right guys, I will see you guys there. Bye. We arrived to school. I don't know if I don't think I've ever left it in in any vlog when I vlog about anxiety when I drive. I get so nervous when it comes to driving now that I just have this horrible gut feeling every time I'm in the car and I'm just like oh, I hate it sometimes. But anyways, I'm at school now and 
I hope you guys are having an awesome vlogmas day and that you guys are watching everybody else's vlogs. Go and check everybody out again uh, after you're done watching this vlog. Go and check some people out that I'm subscribed to. Everybody is so awesome. <sighs> We're out of the appointment. That took like two minutes. <laughs> it was like the fastest appointment ever. And I'm, do I'm so dumb I forgot the paper. One of the papers that I needed to give the counselor. But it's all good. Um, I have another appointment. And I'm not going to be starting school until next year, so. He told me, like, happy holidays, and that was basically the end of the appointment. So now we're getting to the car. <sighs> I have to pee. And, um, it smells like Chinese food. I have to go. <laughs> Bye. So I'm at Albertsons now because, um, backstory, first of all. Um, when me and my husband were dating, when my husband and I were dating, <laughs> um, I had made him a little, um, birthday party like a very small it was just like me and him and I got him this cute little cheesecake and it had different flavors it was like raspberry chocolate coffee it was like a bunch of different flavors so I know they sell it here at Albertsons and I kind of want to go back to that time because it's literally it was his favorite birthday ever and I had them put happy birthday on the little cheesecake and I brought him like balloons and stuff so I'm gonna see if they'll write like I love you or happy anniversary or something on the cake um and I really hope they have the cheesecake. If not, I'm going to be really sad, but I'm going to find something else. So that is why we're here. Let's go. I'm obsessed with like the gingerbread man, so I bought him this little cookie. Isn't it so cute? I'm going to give it to him right now. Hey, look it. <gasps> look what I found. Look what I found. He was following me. He was chasing me. What do you think? Who is that? He's a candy. It's a gingerbread man. Come on. Oh, go Let's see. Show me the cookie. Say cheese. Cheese. <laughs> Evan, hold him like this with his feet. Like that. Let's see. Right here. Right there. Yes. Good. Let me see the cookie. Show me the cookie. A little bit lower. There you go. Yeah. Evan, you gonna eat your cookie? <gasps> oh, yeah. oh no. Oh no! Oh my goodness! He lost his ear! <laughs> Is it yummy? You love it? Mmm! Eat his ear! Bye bye, Cookie! What's his name? That's the gingerbread man. Bye bye, gingerbread man. Is he good? Is he delicious? Oh no! Ouch! Ouch! <laughs> <laughs> On a time crunch now. I need to make dinner and it needs to come out absolutely amazing because it is our anniversary. Um, they didn't have the cheesecake that I wanted. They had a smaller one, which is individual slices, one for him, one for me, but we're going to share them. And I asked the lady, and she was super, super, super nice if she could write I love you on them because happy anniversary just would not. I don't think it would fit on such a small cheesecake. So I'm going to show you guys. It came out really cute. And I'm really excited about it. How cute are they? They say I love you. Now he's getting sad because he has no head. Let me see. Where what happened? Is his foot gone? In his arms? Oh. It's okay, we'll make more later, okay? Yeah? Oh my gosh, I'm so excited! My dad is like in town and it's so unexpected. He just called and he said he's gonna like come by. So you guys get to meet him and I get to give him a big old hug and, and the little one gets to see his grandpa. And I have to finish dinner, wash dishes so that they can like sit on my couch and be inside our house for a little bit. I'm really excited. Deep breaths. Okay, I'll see you guys in the next clip. I'm so excited. This is like super unexpected and awesome twist to the day. Ah! And I'm making some broccoli and carrots, some teriyaki chicken with um, pineapple, and then I have some steaming hot white rice. So that's gonna be for dinner. Yummy, 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 yummy. I decided that I was going to do some really quick um, putting together of gifts for my dad, for his wife, and then the little girl that they have. Um, so I'm going to show you guys the gifts, and I'm really happy, and I hope they like them, even though it was like kind of last minute, and I hope they like them anyways. 
so this one's for the little girl, it has a little candy cane, and then this one's for my dad, and then this one's for his wife. So how cute, right? Simple. Anniversary flowers, they're beautiful. Comment down below how beautiful they are. I love them so much. Thank you. That's for my dad and his family, and we're gonna see. Gabriel's gonna pick his own, his first own donut. I'm so really excited about this. Let's go. Sprinkles. You like that one? Those are sprinkles. Hello. So these are the donuts. I got this little star donut for their little girl. I got this one, I think, for my dad. This one's for me, and then I got this one for his wife, which has like filling inside, which I really don't like filling inside donuts. But look how nice they look. Diddy. The little one's enjoying his. Is it good? Almost here. I'm so excited. I have started the coffee machine. I have the donuts over there. I'm gonna set them up really cute and they're gonna come and I can't wait. I don't know if they're gonna be too shy to be on camera so if I can get some video of them I will and if not I'm sorry but I don't want to be shoving the camera in their face either. Um, but for sure I'm gonna try to get a picture with my dad and Gabriel and I'm really excited. I haven't seen my dad in a while, so it's gonna be nice to spend some time. And you guys get to meet him too. So, I'll see you guys in the next clip. Bye! I hope they're okay. I don't know. Yeah. But they're large. Mhm. Mm it's good. Yeah. Yes. 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 So. I'm feeling all kinds of feels right now. I feel like happy and I feel sad. So I'm feeling all the feels, like I said, and my dad left already. They weren't here for that long, but I couldn't stop hugging him. It's like you don't realize how much you miss somebody until you see them and then you're like having to say goodbye. And it's like, mm. look, I'm getting teary-eyed just talking about it. I'm just really happy and I feel really blessed right now because I got to see him. <sighs> and more importantly than me getting to see him, my little one got to see him. So I'm going to insert some pictures that I was able to take and I did get a little bit of video while he was opening his present and I really hope that um, those gifts were something that were like, that they're going to use them and that it's going to help them out, you know? Um, and they actually said, because they're, like, doing all kinds of, um, like, travels that they need to do, um, that they weren't going to have a Christmas and that they didn't even think they were going to get any presents or anything. And I felt, like, really happy that I was able to, you know, they're, they're simple, they're little gifts and stuff, but they really appreciate it and it made me feel really nice. So, so I'm feeling all the feels. So before I get too emotional... <laughs> Here's the pictures that I was able to take, and I hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog. Um, and I'm gonna go ahead and end it on this happy and like this bittersweet moment. Um, and I'll see you guys very, very soon, like tomorrow. If you guys have liked this video, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you have not already. And bye, 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 guys. Bye, guys.